I knew this outfit was wrong. I'll be back in 15 minutes. What? But rich people who are not attentive to their kids, there's a reason why they have multiple nannies. If he gets cranky, read him his book. Thank you. I would never let my child out of my sight in front of an adult I don't know. This week's episode of Two Freckled Friends is brought to you by Similac. I don't have babies, but I heard that ish with inflation is expensive as hell. I have nothing to say to this. I don't drink milk at all. If you can, please breastfeed your kids, hook them on the titty, and donate titty juice to other people who are unable to breastfeed. I don't think all mother's milk is created equal though. I agree with that. It depends on their diet. And how many holes they have in their forearm. You understand? Morphine is bad for you. Hold on, crackhead is outside yelling. Hey, what's up everybody? It's your girl, Allie. Okay, it's Brooke and Brooke. We appreciate you tuning in to a brand new episode of Two Freckled Friends. If you like your mother's milk forearm hole free, please make sure you like, comment, and subscribe to the channel by clicking on that beautiful button, as well as tapping on the bell icon to stay up to date with the latest notifications as to when we drop new episodes right here on Two Freckled Friends. This week, word on the street is, it's not a dog eat dog world, it's a babies on babies on babies world. Brooke, why don't you tell everyone out there what we're watching this week? Today we are watching 1994 Babies Day Out. I have not seen this movie since it came out in 1994. So quite honestly, I just remember Baby Roman. I actually got a book form of this at the book fair at school. I think I was, what, in the first grade? Did Fox make this? Because if Fox made this movie, we know what happens with the book special here at TFF. 20th Century Fox, yeah. I've never seen this movie before. Now that we know it's classified as a book special, please add me to your prayer list. These are the three ingredients that make up a book special. Not not Disney animation. The probability of Aunt Martha having a bootleg of this on VHS. No. Two and three. I have not seen this movie beginning to end. Three ingredients. <laughs> <laughs> that make up a Brooke special. But if you're brand new to our channel, what Brooke and I are going to do is we're going to watch Baby's Day Out. We'll give our own thoughts. And from those thoughts, we will provide this movie with its official freckle score. So without further ado, it is the one, the only, Baby's Day Out. Let's roll it. Here we go. And three, two, one, play. That's definitely the bookshelf of a 90s child. Snakes and other reptiles, read it yourself. You know I love a good 90s instrumental. Why does this look so 1950s? Is Cynthia Nixon? <laughs> what? He's not an artist slash bartender. No aspirations beyond shaking the cocktails and refilling the peanut bowl. Not Fred Thompson. All right, so they're kind of telling us the story of what's happening. Where's this baby now? Oh. Is that Cynthia? Couldn't we read another book? What the hell? We've read this one a hundred times. Nanny Gilbertine is so tired of the boo boo book. Boo boo. What accent is that? <laughs> all right, all right. I think I like her with her red better. Hello. Shut up, shut up, shut up, shut up, shut up. Thank you. That's a house for that ass. She was manifesting her sex in the city future in that house. Go on a wonderful adventure. You will see the many, many sights of the big city. Look at that baby. Baby Boo felt very grown up indeed. First trip away from mother and father. Baby's having his picture taken this morning. Say hello to old Willie for me. I've hired downtown baby photographers. Darling, old Willie's been photographing Cotwell Baby since the Great Depression. He hasn't had a picture in the paper in, in over 20 years. Baby Bink is almost a year old and virtually unknown. No. The only way to quiet that kind of talk is to have our small-minded friends open up their newspapers. Oh, I want everything in that truck. Look at the Crayola crayon. Oh, that is definitely 90s. Two, they have piggy banks like that? Yeah, they were. You dropped a little coin at the top. This is my bank. I'm trying to say it, my... Cutwell. Cutwell. Bennington Austin Cotwell. That's money for that ass. That's a name. My name is Waldo Aloysius Johnston III. Mm -hmm. Have a wonderful day. What did you forget? Oh, oh my, my God. Bad. I thought it was Thank you. Woo. What else? Kiss the baby. Kiss your child. Oh. Bye-bye. 
Bye bye. Uh, get your thumbs Ooh. out your nose. Oh my god, Cypher? Hello, Trinity. Cypher, where's Tank? I bet you never saw this coming. Lead detective in criminal minds. A decorated officer. And this is not how you want to be remembered. You're in control here. You write the ending. Baby Bink is not a regular baby. Not the cloth diaper. Ooh, that's an estate for that ass. So they rob rich people. The robbers pose as photographers and rob rich. And white women eat this shit up for real? Yeah, that's straight out of a Ralph Lauren catalog. That was on Oprah's favorite things. The hottest ticket in town! A charming good day to you, sir. Mr. Charlie, photographer, the babe. At your sir. That is a horrible accent. Even he sees bullshit. I smell something. Bullshit. We're here for the hit of a lifetime. Oh, they want to ransom the baby, don't they? You want to be a shoplifter? Go to J.C. Penny. Come on, J.C. Penny. Penny. Hey, hey, I love hey. your style. Oh, the J.C. Penny Christmas wish book. Oh. Really think we can get away with this? <laughs> she don't do nothing, but she stay ready. <laughs> oh. What a gorgeous baby. I'm Mrs. Cartwell. I am Mr. Charlie. The help recognizes he's bullshit. But Mrs. Cotwell don't see through it. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> do it again. Let's do it again. Those mustaches are terrible. Kevin McAllister as a baby. You are absolutely right. Exactly. Wow. <sighs> Individual photos of baby bank. Drunk on milk. Uh -huh, what time is it? You photographed the children of a number of my dear friends. She wants the baby to be a Gerber baby. There's only one baby like yours, and only one baby food like ours, Gerber. This picture's never been published. Okay. Aww, the baby's cute though. You didn't have a baby just to have him turn into a child model. What are you doing? What? Girl, are you sure? I want you to set a new standard for beauty and baby photography. This is what rich people do? Yes, because they don't spend time with their kids. May I have some time alone with the child? No, you can't have fucking alone time with the child. What kind of fucking question is that? Actually, screw that. Get the fuck out of my house. I'll hire somebody else. To learn how best to, to photograph him. You couldn't get away with that shit today. Am I wrong? I'm just trying to figure out why Cynthia Nixon's blush is so dark. I'm gonna need you to pay attention because you miss it a lot. Fuck her makeup. She looked like oatmeal. We got it. I knew this outfit was wrong. I'll be back in 15 minutes. What? But rich people who are not attentive to their kids, there's a reason why they have multiple nannies. If he gets cranky, read him his book. Thank you. I would never let my child out of my sight in front of an adult I don't know. Even in front of an adult, I do know I wouldn't do that shit. Oh no, that's weird. Oh my God. That is absolutely weird. Hurry to the attic and get the winter wardrobe. But madam. Hurry, Gilbertine. <laughs> That was too easy. Take the book. We gotta make this fast. Ooh, that's pretty. That's very Jacqueline Kennedy Onassis. I'm sorry it took so long. And Jack Yoki. Where's Bank? Million in 1994. What would that be today? Tasty. So good and tasty. I'm gonna ask a question I don't think a lot of people will be able to answer easily. If you had the money, would you pay the ransom? How do you tell the front from the back on these diapers? The front and the back are the same. Probably don't make no difference. Put them in them regular baby clothes. Fruit suits are dead giveaway to these. Ooh! <laughs> Watch the baby. <laughs> Put him in the bedroom. The more he sleeps, the less attention he draws from the neighbors. Nappy nap be not time, little jerk. Go to sleep real nice. Drinking with the Bobby dolls and he needs his rest. What kind of off-brand is that? Can't even fit in the bowl. He's talking about retiring on $5 million split three ways. I don't think that can happen. A million dollars used to go a long way. You know a million dollars is crumbs today. It's not really a retirement. What is it? It's working every day. 11 million Americans, one in five over 65, still working. I'm not gonna shake, so I'm gonna shake, we have little lamb. Well, they taking a note after Sister Act 2. Come on now, sing. Mary had a little lamb. Okay, 
Okay, okay. Oh, his teeth. Girl, you see? You see the... Wake one day, wake one day. Very lost a job. Yeah, that's real. She went to unemployment. <laughs> This thing and read him his storybook. He like, you smell funny, sir. Manny and baby boo. Oh, he don't know to read? Kids, you don't know what we're talking about, but there was an alphabet, and you could take letters from that alphabet and arrange them in certain ways to form these things called words, and those could be used to communicate ideas. Aww. He know he can't read either. Troll. Deep department. Department store. Many, many things there were to buy. Look at them bonding. Oh, fingerprints. <laughs> yep. Oh, now she dressed for business. Dale Grissom. FBI. Ah, Fred Thompson. We're engaged in a public debate now over a technique. Very few people know anything about or its application, what the circumstances are of its application and so forth. I'm going to look for my baby. Okay. Now it would be pointless and dangerous for you to go out searching for your baby. Yeah, you had plenty of time to change your wardrobe, didn't you? Yeah, go ahead and cry. Take your time. Have you ever lost a child? No, because I wouldn't leave them alone with a fucking stranger. I apologize. Don't apologize, Fred. Check her ass. Honestly, you should have Cynthia go look for her, because Cynthia knows the baby better than exactly. you. <laughs> Sit your ass in the corner. I'm gonna go look for my baby. Where? I'm gonna go back to Tara. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> and God in my wit, I'll never be hungry again. Aww, he went to sleep. <laughs> That ugly ass pigeon. <laughs> nope, gotta go. How y'all leave that whole ass window open like that? You know that fire escape is not up to code either. <laughs> ooh, ooh. Bro. Oh. Lord, that baby with the shards of glass. <laughs> what I do? <laughs> that glass. <laughs> you jerk! <sighs> You're gonna wake up the baby! The baby's on the road! <laughs> Lord have mercy. Hurry! <laughs> Come on, hurry! Look how movie set. You can tell this is a movie set. Eddie, are you okay? <laughs> Bullshit, leave these things lying around. What are you doing? Go! Eddie! <laughs> Eddie, you're drooling. Eddie, Eddie. Eddie come, come on. You're Eddie, right. what happened? Eddie. You just crawl up in somebody else's house. It's gonna be at least a thousand feet. We're gonna have to jump. We're gonna jump? Yes. No. No. <laughs> okay. Three. Three. Oh, oh, oh. oh shit. Oh shit. Oh shit. <laughs> oh my god. Package. Where do you want me to sign? He's a moving little baby. Remember when postal people like that used to be nice? Damn. Look at his little cheeks. Are you all right? Crawling all over the city. Look at him go. Ah, uh, that's where the bus uh... comes in. Hey, Eddie, how many figures I got up? You okay? <laughs> <laughs> Bus driver. Lady in front of you. I'll jump on the back. The back of me, not. There he is. Let's see him. He's gone. We lost him. Whoa. Look both ways. Look both ways. Driver, next stop, please. We're going for a little ride. Wait, stop the bus. Stop the bus. She hasn't noticed that her bag is heavier? Did baby get off this bus? I didn't have nobody today with a baby. You must have got off! If you didn't park your van on hey. the side, a lot easier! <laughs> Wake up. Realization. I seen him. He's in the big brother's purse. What do you mean? Will you stop with your oh. I'm still confused how she hasn't noticed her bag is much heavier. Hello, thank you, and good night. She knows that they're following her. Uh -oh. <laughs> Lord, that's some WCW right there. Hey, hey, go. Beat his ass. Who's next? He just put my fist in your mouth. Is anybody else want to take a shot? Chicken! There you go, sis. You got it. And you still look good. Oh, yeah, Macy's? <laughs> little face. How 
did you get out of Mother Goose Corner? There's a lot of redheads in this. John, you got a type? Hey, figure, that's my type. That's my type, that's my type. You got a nasty little surprise for me? <laughs> you guys are worthless. I'm getting sick of your insults. What money? The kid is gone! <laughs> Oh, a little tight. What is $5? So they will watch your kids while you shop? Really? For $5? Oh, another baby. Oh, damn. Okay. Why are you crying? This is your fault. She's scowling. Our sources tell us that a nine-month-old baby boy was abducted from the downtown baby photographer studio. Oh, uh, Duncan's toy chest. My, my, my. Where did you get all that money? I have a lot of grandmothers. Well, that explains it. He just lets it happen too. <laughs> Nobody looks down. Everybody is that self involved. Keep rolling. Okay. Ah! Really, you would risk being on camera? <laughs> He's enjoying this way too much. Hello, is this Mr. Cotwell? Joe Depke. Listen, I might have some information on the whereabouts of that child. I seen the baby right across the street on the curb. Where'd he go? And this is the part where he's like, give him $100. Please, your money's no good here. Put it away, huh? Where's the baby? House across the street. Second floor. McCray's. I called because I care. Oh. Mm -hmm. How much you get? You care about that dental work, didn't you? Or a shower. He's very greasy. Ooh, get away. Greasy ass man. I still think it's me. He still hasn't showered, has he? Your name's McCray? We're looking for a missing child. These are my kids. Warren? To come all up in my house? She knows where her kids are. Damn! Sir, in here. That's not bank. You have all the money in the world and you couldn't watch your one child. This woman who clearly has less and has more kids. Come on. Has more maternal instincts. Mm. Mm -hmm. Clear your throat. Lubricate. Mm -hmm. And read that bitch. You have a beautiful little boy. Especially when you don't have a career and you have the time to nurture, have those motherly bonds. I pray he comes back to you. And you know what? Your husband's so free to give money. You should be paying for her child shit for a year and barge in my fucking house like that. To the man across the street. I'm sorry for the trouble. Someone somewhere watches over the babies. Yes, I hope so. Clearly your wife ain't. Yeah. Yeah. Hello. Oh, no, 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 sweetheart. Not by the muffler. No, 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 no. Yay. Oh, my Lord. They're going to hit this child. Now, you know I feel bad if I'm asking God to protect the white children. Jesus. At what point do you start to feel bad for the kidnappers? At what point do I start feeling bad for the citizens of Chicago? You can't even go two blocks without seeing a cop car. I have yet to see one fucking cop car anywhere near these Muppets. Come on, buddy. Come on. My money! My money? My money? They are working as hard to steal that child as the way Stanley Tucci was trying to steal Beethoven. <laughs> 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 broken toes they should not be able to do that ah! Allie they shouldn't have been able to do a lot of things I worked at Burger King three years did you have it your way BK, have it your way yeah. this is worse than that you idiot are the reason we don't got the kid you don't deserve a penny wait a minute wait a minute thing. babies are obviously more dangerous than we thought they ain't afraid of nothing they damn sure ain't guess what fellow freckles we have some exciting news Two Freckled Friends now has an official Kofi page. Kofi is the best way to stay up to date with what's going on with the channel, as well as being able to make donations or contributions. People have been asking us what's the best way to donate to the channel, and you can do that from Kofi. K-O-F-I.com forward slash Two Freckled Friends. You can choose any type of donation, whether it's one time or monthly. If you're not able to financially contribute, no worries. Brooke and I are having so much fun making these episodes. We're gonna make Two Freckled Friends the biggest, best, baddest show it can possibly be. But if you're feeling generous with that tax refund, <laughs> I'm talking to you, Spanky. The website is Kofi, K-O-F-I.com forward slash Two Freckle Friends. Again, Kofi.com forward slash Two Freckle Friends. We'll also drop the link in the description below. All right, back to the show. 
baby tracks. Oh lord. Milk? Is that milk? Is that Similac? Lord, they got that damn Chuck E. Cheese character as a gorilla. Terrible animatronics. <laughs> Goes of five million bucks, huh? Oh, so it was apples. I think that's what it was around his mouth. Easy. You're not taking my. Oh <laughs> shit! You're not taking my baby. Oh, oh, oh! I'm gonna sit next to you. Oh. Oh. Ah! His hand is broke. Where are the cameras inside of the zoo? Where's the janitor? Joint the baby. Why are they trying to be gingerly about this damn? Oh. I know you don't want to hear this, but the kid's gone again. Mm, he's lonely. This morning, all I wanted was my baby's picture in the paper. You're a selfish Shut whore. Up. I got my wish. Yeah, you did. You got yeah. it. Where's your mommy? Exactly. Thank you. Finally, somebody. No. No, 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 no. Outside of the baby, she's the only character I've rooted for this entire film. Oh! Baby, starboard side. Did baby Bink miss his Uncle Eddie? How's the baby crawling faster than y'all? Where'd he go? Get it, Today ain't your lucky day. <laughs> Beautiful day, huh? You left the engine running. Yes. Oh! You guys uh, seen a baby around here? Yeah, well, it's been a kidnap. It's amazing what people will do for money. Yeah, for five million. See anything. <laughs> oh. Chestnuts roasting on an open fire. Welcome to the car. My entire reproductive system is about to go up in flames. You still want that five million? <laughs> it's not worth it. Stop, drop, roll! Stop, Stop drop, drop, and roll! roll. You got burned clear through your skivvies. He needs a fucking hospital. I'm feeling woozy, yeah. Girl, you wasn't trying to find no baby. You would have thrown on some sweats. Look, it's his actual mother. I'm sorry, ma'am. No, don't be sorry. That's her child. She lost your child. I haven't forgotten your feelings. My feelings don't matter. Yes, they do. You're his mother. Look, she don't even know how to fold clothes. Look at her. I do very much. I love my baby's gotten has been as much yours as mine. Greater than, not equal to. Probably more. Not with you, bitch. Her freckles are not welcome here. If he were home, he'd be going down for his nap. She don't even know the schedule of his day. Damn. Look at his mama. Miranda, we take back what Brooke said about your teeth because you channeled those motherly instincts in season two and three when you had your son. Got it. Got it. What you did, that is love. You love. Where is this little boy now? Oh no, not the caterpillar! Girl, you know I- Okay, that little boy has boogers in his nose. Well, he see Donut, he know the deal. <laughs> he said everybody runs on Duncan. It's very advanced science, algebra, formulas. You know, there's a lot that goes into this. You can't just come up with a name. Terrible movie set backdrop painting. Uh. Who agreed to this fake ass backdrop? In there. I'm with the union. Where else would you be? I'm gonna need 
need, sir, I'm gonna need, I'm gonna need for you to just sit down. He'll never be able to use the restroom or make love the same ever again. He'll never be able to sit down the same. Baby, 12 o'clock. Andre, home crazies, men's heads, babies. Second floor, hardware, children's wear, ladies' lingerie. The girder comes up, jump out on it, and grab the baby. Can y'all stop fighting on the edge? After adding weight to the beam, did no one think about this? Like a seesaw? Hello, physics. <laughs> Probably can't spell physics. Exactly, thank you. How did you do that? Baby luck. None of these construction workers notice this. I'm losing my grip. Help me, guys. That's gonna hold him? Oh. There he is! There he is! Oh, he got a nice bubble butt. Girl, I'm happy you mentioned it because I was sitting there looking too. Hey, yay, we there together. My God! Get back up there! No, no, repent and leave. Come here, you little ball of grief! Not Concretia. I love this stuff. I'm gonna name it after my daughter, Concretia. This isn't funny anymore. My money! <laughs> Ew. Ew. Don't. Don't do it. Please yeah, don't do, do it because it's this or jail. Just go to jail. Just go to jail. I told you. Going to jail this time. <laughs> He's still asleep. Baby! We better go before I drive! There was a report of a man looking for a lost baby on a bus this morning. Part much store care center. Three o'clock at the zoo. Report not long ago at a, a building. A building under construction. See? Look at Nanny. He's doing everything in the book. I know where he is. Go find our son. <laughs> but how does this kid have a sense of direction, though? Yeah. It's the kid. On television, the one that. Oh, Mr. Duckett! You and your baby went to town, but this is Warren. Hey, hey. I want my nanny. Fuck you. You ain't do shit. Nanny is getting a 500% raise and all her student loans paid for. Had quite an adventure today. <gasps> Oh, they took the book with him. That's oh, what he thinks. Boo. Was there a TikTok in his book? No. Pointing to his boo boo. He wants his boo boo. Turn around. We're going back to the TikTok to get the boo boo. Why are you clapping? Y'all went back home. <laughs> boo boo. You dirty, stupid little stupid. The end of you being a mother. I'm divorcing you and marrying Cynthia Nixon. Your freckles have been disassociated. Your membership has been revoked. Good night, sweetheart. Y'all gonna put him alone in his room after the day I had? No. <laughs> Let's give it a freckle scar. Alrighty, it is time for Brooke and I to give Baby's Day Out its official freckle score. Watching it 30 years later, you see all these people who were in the movie and it's actually a good time. What's his name? Bink? Binky? Well, Biddington Jr.? He was definitely an infant version of Kevin McAllister slash Ferris Bueller. There was definitely a gap in terms of the funding and the production for the film. If it was, it could have been a better movie. And I mean, the physical comedy was there, but this was a little bit more slapstick. Could have been cleaner. Cynthia Nixon as the nanny, she was the G. I would give Baby's Day 
day out 3.15 freckle score out of five. What I'm about to say is rare, very rare. So I do not take this lightly. Brooke said everything I was going to say, took the words right out of what would have been my mouth. The only thing I'll say is free Bennington from that trash ass mama. My freckle score for baby's day out is going to be three and a half out of five freckles. Drop your thoughts in the comments if you agree or disagree with our scores. And while you're down there, please make sure to like and subscribe to the channel by clicking on that beautiful button as well as tapping on the bell icon to stay up to date with the latest notifications as to when we drop new episodes right here on Two Freckle Friends. Every thought I had, you said it. <laughs> Total of 13 mechanical babies to stand in for twins Jacob and Adam Wharton whenever the action got risky or they got cranky. Okay, this is one we call the back end baby. Here we can see for shots where it crawls out the room like this. You see this part, it kind of gives it away. You know, but again, it was always only meant to be seen like this. You know, so there's just as much of it that operates. But for us, if a baby's coming up and, and touching your face and touching your glasses, I'm going to grab your glasses here. Wow.